Hi there, I'm Miss Katie and I'm the Teen Services Librarian here at 95th Street Library. It is finally December, so we're going to be getting a little holly jolly today and making a DIY paper circuit holiday card. So they're going to look a little like this and they light up and they're so fun. What you're going to find in your craft kit is your instructions for the craft. You'll have three light emitting diodes or LEDs. They're gonna be in clear, which comes out kind of white with the light, red and orange. You'll have a piece of copper tape. A coin cell battery. Looks like that a little bit. your card, and this is just regular cardstock. You could use any kind of cardstock if you're doing this at home. And of course our cutouts. So today we've got a snowman, a reindeer, and a tree. And then optionally also included in your kit, you may have gotten one of these little sparkly tinsel pipe cleaners. You can use it in your card, you don't need to, it's totally up to you. So, let's get started. We are going to start with the front of our card facing us, and you can tell which side is the front because if you look inside your card, the back side of your card is going to have a couple of circles with a plus and a minus. Those circles are where we're going to place our battery later on. So, this is our front side. And you'll want to pick your template. You could either pick the reindeer, the tree, the snowman. I really enjoy the snow, so I'm going to go with our friend Mr. Snowman. Um, I've already colored him in. You could color him however you'd like. I've put a little bit of glue just from a glue stick on the back of my snowman. And I'm just going to paste it right onto the card. And you could put it at the top, at the bottom, in the middle. Maybe think about where you'd like to put any words on the card. So this is where I'm putting my snowman. Once you've placed your template, what you'll want to do is cut a hole in your card, either with a hole punch or scissors. Please be very careful during this part. That hole is where your LED is going to come through. So for our snowman, I put a hole kind of right here so that we can put the orange LED, so it kind of looks like the snowman's nose. Now as you get started, you might make it a little bit easier on yourself in trying to figure out where exactly the LED is going to go on the inside of the card by just putting a little dot that goes through to the other side. So that's going to be our guide. If you look, there's just a tiny little dot here. So we're going to open our cards. You have a circle with a plus, a circle with a minus on it. That is for our coin cell battery. It has a positive side and a negative side. And those are those circles are just the way that it is going to correspond. So with our pluses and minuses all straightened out, we're going to get started with our copper tape. It has some paper on the back so it doesn't get sticky right away. You'll peel that paper back. And we'll start on the plus side. So starting from the circle that has the plus on it, you can peel back some of this tape. And you stick it right to the circle. And you can peel it back as you go. Kind of stick it along the way. And then I'm going to show you real quick how to do a corner turn because that's where it gets a little bit complicated. To turn on your corners, what you're going to want to do is fold it back kind of like this. Do you see how we're forming a 90 degree angle? We're folding it back just a little bit. And then to fold it back forward, you could hold it down and fold it right on itself just like that. And that's how we make sure that we've got a continuous line of copper tape. So we will put that right about to where our LED is going to be with that mark. 
And then at that point, you can just cut it right there. All right, so we've got our copper tape all set. It's going from the circle with the plus sign all the way around to where our dot is, where the LED is going to go. We're gonna do the same thing on the other side with the circle with the minus sign in it. And you'll just peel back your copper tape like you did the first time. And then we're gonna start by sticking it to that circle with the minus sign. And same kind of thing, you'll just go around. All right. And again, to do that turn, you fold it back first to create an angle there. And then we fold it back on itself so that the sticky side comes right through. And then we'll stick it down. Get your line up to here. And then again for the turn, we'll fold the tape back. And it looks a little like this. And then fold it back forward on itself once again. So that we can turn that corner. And then you'll get to kind of near where the dot is. And once again, we're just gonna cut the copper tape right there. All right, once we've got all of our copper tape down, all lovely like that, this is where the fun begins. So we are gonna bring in our LED. Again, I went with the orange one for the snowman. And if you look at that LED, if you look real close, you'll see that there is a longer pin and a shorter pin. So the longer pin is called the cathode. And that is what connects to our positive source. And then the shorter pin is called the anode and that connects to our negative source. So that is why we had circles with the pluses and minuses. That's the way that our battery is going to connect. And that's the way that we're going to put it on our card. So what you'll want to do is bend those pins back. They will not break, they're flexible. So we bent that pin. We're gonna bend the pin on the other side as well. And it'll look something like this. And then all you're gonna wanna do is very carefully Peel back your copper tape just a bit so that your LED is going to light up right on the dot where it's supposed to be. So again, our positive side goes over here and then to peel this guy back a little bit. Our negative side will go here. And if you've got a little bit of extra copper tape, which I do here, you can just cut that and it'll still work just okay. So we'll stick it down. And you wanna make sure that the LED pins are definitely touching the copper tape and the contact is good because that's what's gonna help it light up. Our LED is down now. Um, it is connected to our copper tape, but you're gonna notice that it doesn't quite light up yet. Why is that? It's gonna be because we have not connected it to a power source and our power source is gonna be our coin cell battery here. So the side with the writing on it is gonna be your positive side. The other side will be negative. So with the circles this way and our LEDs pin pointing this way, this side is going to be the positive, so we want to make sure that the positive side is touching the copper tape right there. And you could connect this 
to your card in any kind of way, I'm just going to use a couple pieces of tape. The point really is that you want to make sure that your battery will be able to touch both this piece of copper tape as well as this piece of copper tape. So if you need to adjust, that's okay too. Okay friends, get ready because this is probably the most exciting part. So what you will do in order to make your LED light up, you're going to take the battery and fold your card over. Fold it so that the battery, this is the negative side, is going to be touching the piece of copper tape that's connected to the negative pin of the LED. Whoa, and it lights up. How cool. Now, also included in your kit, you're going to find a paper clip. You can absolutely connect that to here so that this stays down. I'm not going to use it quite right now. So what we'll want to do is we'll push the LED right through the hole of your card here. So here's our snowman's nose. And he lights up. Isn't that super fun? I'll leave my LED turned off just for right now, but the next step, of course, is just to decorate your card however you'd like. So we have this snowman, but the snowman does not really have any kind of features. So we'll give him some eyes. He has his nose. Give him a little smile and some buttons down the front here and then really you can decorate this however you want we're just gonna say a little happy holidays and we'll say from our favorite place Naperville Public Library. So I hope that you enjoyed. I hope you have lots of fun with this and happy holidays.